am. What the fuck? What? Man, the... shut the hell up, bro. Why you got on your Why you got on your mama dress, bro? It's mine, you asshole. What the? F I can't do this. Like, the turn around. This does absolutely nothing for your eyes, sweetie. Like, this is not your color. Bad. You know I hate wearing this shit. I'm just playing with you. I'm just trying to lighten the mood. Plus, it's only for like a couple of hours, so. And I've been told you to move out anyway. You know I can't move out. But you're right, you're right. It's just for church, just for bullshit appearances. If she wasn't paying for school, I'd be off of this. Yeah, I feel it. But you gotta you gotta live your own life at some point. You feel me? Like it's not healthy living for your mom all the time. We gotta be out on our own. You gotta do you. You gotta be you. You feel me? Mm -hmm. And you're pretty gay outside of church anyway. I mean, uh, we get bitches outside of church. Yeah. You feel, but I can't, you can't be my wingman dressed like this. Like, what? What is this? Little house I'll be work? the ultimate wingman with this on because they all gonna fly. It's a you. fucking wing. That's what I think. <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, oh, hey, what you mean? Oh. Uh, your mom, your mom told me to tell you to put these on, so you need to. I'm not, I'm not about to put these Nigga, on. We cannot leave this house if you don't. <laughs> Nigga, you got the dress on, you got to have the ear. You wear your hair like this too? Yeah. You look like you just got out of jail. Like, you know what? I don't care. You got, you got money on your commissary. Yeah, that's yeah, that's funny. Very funny. It's okay, okay. Funny. It's not funny. funny. I ain't going to laugh no more. But look, I'm going to do something with my own. You wearing these? You wearing these? Or are you going to wear these? Like, uh, white or matter of fact, Oh, you got stuff just these. Nigga, who need to be two inches off the ground, Zion? Uh, you can't go big or go home. I'm trying to go home. I see you take me to the king head ass. Listen, you can't even walk on water in these. Hey, yo, ma. No, ma. ma, no, ma. come get you. Come get Audrey. No, come go get, get you out of this dress. What's up? You gonna make me fall. Oh my, what no, get out, just this. get out. Forget this, 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 this is our norm. This is our norm. This is our norm. Is our norm. It's our norm. This is our norm. Hey, big head. Hey, what's up? Apparently, whatever you doing, keep it secrets much. Mm mm. My business. You my are my business. business. And what's new? <laughs> what you about to do? What you mean? I'm chilling. Well, do you love me? Wait, wait, before you answer, let me get my face right. <laughs> Do you love me? No. Mmm, mmm, did that feel good? I felt real good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. What? Okay, what? What? What you want? What do you want? What okay, you want? so I'm having company, mm -hmm. FYI. Yeah. And I just need for you to find, find. something to do outside of the house in my in my room for just a little bit in this space like a few hours right here out there inside <laughs> uh, okay Please. You know, that's fine is it? come on you can find something mm. else to do out there mm. yeah. no no wow she was just here she was just here yeah, and I just I just got y'all I tried to get y'all something the other day and you shot me down. And now you want me to now now you want me to I know, but I just need just a little bit of time. Just Okay, I see. Okay. It's like a few hours. So you know what? It's um it's actually happy hour at Magianos and you know I love Magianos. And so they they got this good it's real Fruity, delicious, frozen daiquiri. So I mean, you know, since since you're trying to kick me out and all, you know, of my own place. First of all, it's our place. Same difference. You know what? Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Here you go, girl. Have fun. Mm. More again. Mm. One, two, three. Bitch, I'm not one of your hoes. Really? You better try it again. I bet you won't. Try it again. Listen. 
Huh. You get one swipe, okay? Swipe or no swiping, okay? Just one, one. is all I need, okay? Oh my God. I can just see the crab legs just calling my name A okay. few hours. See, you got a couple of appetizers tonight, and I got to eat me some too, okay? Whatever, get the fuck out. And if you really go to Maggiano, you need to pick me up a plate. Thank you. I'll think about just it. Just scamming ass. Mm -hmm. Don't you love it? Check out the headphones, what you gonna do, man? Oh, we gonna be alright. Yeah, come in, chipping down my thigh. We gotta talk. Talk about what? Th wait, chill, Morgan. Chill. Yeah, what the fuck is wrong with you? What the fuck, Morgan. This has gotta stop. The fuck? Don't tell me you catching feelings too. Really? Clearly not. I just thought I could come here, like, have a conversation with you. And tell you like it's just seriously. Oh my god. More so you cutting me off. No. Nope. Yep. Yes. Yes. Yes, I am. Seriously? Yes, Zion likes you. Okay. Like, she really likes you. I can just I can just feel it in her energy. Like, you know what I mean? Of course you know what I mean. You fucking Morgan. You you read like neonatal charts and shit. Yeah, I know what you mean. That's my problem. Why? Because she's my best friend, I don't want to fuck it up, Morgan. Why create turmoil in an otherwise healthy relationship? So I'm affected because you and your butt buddy can't what? Figure out how life works? First of all, she's not my butt buddy. Uh, uh, okay, okay, she's okay. She's my butt buddy. But okay. Second of all, what? Why are we naked? Why? Why? Who's ready? That's besides the point, Morgan. It's just sex. I know that, and you know that. Okay, then. But the rest of the world doesn't get that two people can just have sex and it not mean anything. Which we do a great job at, by the way. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> but, oh, man. You should just explain it to her. Do, do you want me to die? Come on. Yeah, you're right. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but no, seriously. I just know she would be devastated. I can just... I just feel it, the way the conversation shifts. Anytime we're talking about you, she's like, I don't know, she might be in love with you. So, so we're done. Okay, it's done. Whew. Oh my God, I thought you were gonna like go like crazy or like put like a spell on me or something. All right, so I'm just, we're great. Cool, I'm just gonna get my stuff. I'm glad that, oh my God, this, this is such a relief. I'm so glad that you did this. I'm just gonna go. Wow, wow. <laughs> okay, that's nice. for the road. I'm working. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. <sighs> Keys work for people who actually live in this house. Oh, so you had the locks changed. It's okay. So you being petty now. Even after saying yes to marrying me? Whoa. First of all, I never even said well, yes. You want to explain no. Exactly though, and you can't even respect no, 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 no. it. Babe, listen. What are you talking about, babe? Wait. Wait, what are you talking about? What are you doing here? Um, I'm, I'm... <laughs> it was a rhetorical question. Like. Tash, you don't, you don't even love me. You don't. What? You, it's been years. 
literally years since we've been together. And you proposed to me for what? For the sake of others to save face trying to keep up with the Joneses? Like, what was the point in all of that? Yo, I'm still here because I love you. I do love you. Is that it? Like, is that all? Is that all? What more do you want? <sighs> My nigga. <laughs> like, you are legit for everybody. My nigga? Yeah, my nigga. I've been trying to make it work with you, bitch. How? With me? Her? Her? Oh, but let's not forget Erica. Erica? Cash. Stop fucking playing with me. All right, all right. You wanted to chat them, right? You wanted to talk? Let's talk about it. Let's do it. Come on. Nah, listen. Why you throwing out random bitches' names in the air? Who the fuck is Erica? Let's talk about that. Yo. And then Cindy even putting words in your ear? Are you serious? Mm. Now we're gonna bring Sid into this because you wanna be a cheater! Mm. You! <sighs> now, Cash, you know me well enough to know that if I come to you with something like this, sweetie, I already know the details. So tell me, who the fuck is Erica? I'm waiting. See, I was trying to tell you it's um Why are you always coming at me about it, Ma? Cause it's just not right, says I. Not right by who? The word, God, me. I mean, are you raised better than this? And you're calling yourself Zion. What does that even mean? So you're bigger than God. And it's who I am. I'm more comfortable using that name than Shaziah. I thought you would like Zion of all people. I, I just, I don't understand why it's so hard for you to at least try to understand me. You preach about acceptance and all this other sh stuff at church, but can't even accept your own child. That's different. How, Ma? How? I am the pastor of the church. You can at least have some respect and not flaunt your ways in the house of the Lord. I, I don't. I even wear what you want me to wear when I come to your church. What is it? Why do you want to be a man? You're such a beautiful young lady. Really? I don't want to be a man. I love being a woman. I'm just more masculine than most women. Do I judge you when you wear your clothes and your wigs to feel comfortable in your body? Those are womenly things. And I'm a woman, but you just don't do those things. My point was that you feel more comfortable when you do those things. Just like I feel more comfortable wearing men's clothing, it feels, it feels right and natural for me. It's not natural. None of it's natural. <laughs> to graduate college, you sure are ignorant. Don't you fix your damn mouth to disrespect me, little girl. I, I honestly wasn't trying to be mad. You're just so close-minded. Look, don't walk away from me when I'm talking to you. Mama said, don't you go tempt them demons. Cause in the saints, they find relief in worldly disbelievance. And mama said, don't write no rhyme if you all right, so we're sitting here with Sebastian and Josiah. How y'all doing today? Good, good, good. good. How you doing? I'm doing well. I'm, I'm really happy that you guys were able to come in and sit with me because, you know, there's a lot happening in the USA with the trans, I don't want to call it an epidemic, but, you know, it's starting to become a big story these days and a lot of headlines. So my first question to you guys is, especially uh, being in the working field and getting to know people, like, how do you deal with essentially coming out again as a trans man to everyone. How does that, like, how does that make you feel if you, you're coming out again? Well, you want me to go first real quick? Whoever. <laughs> <laughs> well, for me, as far as the work environment, I'm completely stealth. Like, okay. I do not want any of my coworkers to ever know. Okay. Like, ever. I work with a bunch of military guys, first of all. Mm. So, that'd be a whole nother ballpark. Like, I cannot... 
Oh, for sure. Like, no. I, and I just don't understand why you even have to come out. I don't know why that has to be a thing. But of course, everybody wants to put a title on everything. Right. So yeah, just yeah, to yeah. kind of get an understanding of who this entity is, oh, there has to be a, there has to be an explanation for this. Yeah. So yeah. like for me, I'm in a position where I have to let people know about my transition, depending on what their position okay. is, um, because of what I do for a living. So in that case, it's really a place of safety. Like. Some gotcha. people, you don't really have a choice to tell. Like, you're my HR, you're my such and such. You have right. to handle certain things. I hate in my that. Person. Yeah, I hate so you that. You don't have no <laughs> choice. And it really is just, you have to, like, find however you're comfortable with it. Like, for me personally, it's like, listen, this is who I am. This is what it says on the paper. This is what I, you know, like to be addressed by. No more front questions. Like, <laughs> no that's, more. that's it. And so then moving forward, anybody else that you're not really concerned about needing that protection per se from them is you just, don't want to tell them. Right. And it's like you right. just you present yourself as a man and you introduce yourself as a man. My name is yeah. Sebastian. My name is Josiah. Josiah right. And that's just what it is. Yeah. We're moving forward from here. Right. Pretty much. Awesome. Yeah, cool. work. I keep work and my life so separate. Like I don't add coworkers on social media. Like, right. I don't do that. It's but, like that meme, yeah. I don't add coworkers, I don't see you do no illegal shit. <laughs> <You're> right. Right. <laughs> right. I'm, I'm saying, look, I don't have to come out too much to anything um, being a lesbian. However, I still keep that same, I keep that separate as well. I was like, listen, you don't need to see how I be shaking my ass right. online right. as opposed to how I say, hi, how are you? <laughs> <laughs> Those are two different people. Oh, yeah. No, I definitely understand that. So how has the love life been? Sheesh. <laughs> <laughs> you go first. Oh, um, <laughs> dating while trans is a battle. Okay, tell like, me more. Meaning there's no specific place that people fit in. Like, if you're a lesbian, you know, you'll find you a lesbian. Right. If you're straight, you're going to find somebody that's straight. Correct. If you're bi, you got to pick of the litter. Like, <laughs> right. When you're trans, there's no place that you fit in. You don't gotcha. fit in with the lesbians because you were born a woman, but you identify trans as a man. man. Like, yeah, trans when you're man. a trans man. Correct. You might have been born a woman, but... You don't identify as a man. You've transitioned. There's are things that are not 100% woman anymore, depending on where you are in your transition. Mm -hmm. right. The same thing with dealing with a straight woman. You're not 100% male from a biological perspective. Mm -hmm. So there are a lot of things from both sides that you're missing. So really, it just barrels down to dating somebody who just accepts you. Like You for you. Yeah. Dating while trans, it affects the person you're dating. So just as much as we, as the trans man, has to be strong, mm -hmm. so does our partner. Oh, absolutely. So you think a lot of the dating world comes, or I'm sorry, the lack of acceptance for dating the trans identi identified person comes from um, the insecurities of the individual that you're trying to date? Um, I wouldn't say insecurities. I would say majority of the time they're just worried about what other people would think. Mm. And then on their end, it's more so of a mind fuck, I've been yeah. told, because they see one thing on the outside. Sorry about that. They see one thing <laughs> on the outside, and but they're behind closed doors with you at the end of the night. Mm. Like, they're the ones that's laid down. It's like another form of being closeted. Like right. Over right, again, right. Or like a down low. Right. Just in a, I don't know, a different form. Yeah. You never really think about, so you guys both date women. Yes. Right? Okay, so you never think about women being in the closet or a down low woman we always talk about down low brothers which right. are mm -hmm. you know straight guys who claim to be straight but at the end of the, you know at the end of the night they want to sleep with a man right. and that's mm -hmm. just what they do so we have women whether they're, they're lesbian or hetero who want to stay in the light of whatever their sexual orientation is but then at the end of the day they have no problem sleeping with trans identified men exactly exactly hmm that's very it's a really it's a really touchy <laughs> subject because yes it does boil down to okay what you have what right. genitals you have in your right. pants i mean that's everybody's preference is different right but some people they can get over that because they love you absolutely like it doesn't matter what you have i want to please you i want to love you no matter what you got going on right i also think a lot of people start to to um combine sexuality with identity yeah yeah and all those are two completely yeah, different all things the time. i think the biggest thing is that people really put too many too much pressure on ladies like, yeah 
that I think that's the biggest thing. A lot of the insecurities, like it's a mind fuck. I'm not going it to the It is yeah. definitely a mind yeah. fuck because it's a mind fuck for us too. Yeah. Like, yeah. I mean, <laughs> um, I was in different about assets. This. Yeah, but like <laughs> I've dated a trans woman. Okay. So it was a mind fuck for both of us, and that's like two like we were battling each other because okay. I hate to say this, but <laughs> you got what I want and I got what you want. Yeah. So we're mm. mad at each other. Like at the end of the day, it just didn't really work out. Wow. We couldn't, you never could couldn't find that middle ground That's versus it make it work. I date a lesbian woman who she's dated nothing but women since she was 16 years old. Yeah. Never dated a man, never been attracted to a trans man until she's dated me. <laughs> so now, yeah. so yeah. now it's are. like, am I no longer a lesbian? Yeah. Like, yeah. So we're am I going what against am I myself? Now? Like, am I now? <laughs> you. I mean, I'm not right. you. At the end of the day, yeah. you're just you. Love yeah. is love, so it really mm -hmm. shouldn't matter if you're attracted to this human being. Exactly. Then you're just attracted to that human being. When we get down to what's underneath the clothes, okay, we can worry about that later. We'll figure this out. Just tell yeah. me how you like to be pleased, and we'll figure that out. Yeah. Right. I love it. Well, I just want to say thank you guys so much for being here. I think we have a lot of informative stuff that the community can hear and I really hope that we can change the perspectives and the minds of anybody who's listening to this so make sure y'all follow us at uh, cootie underscore cootie queens on Instagram and then we're also on YouTube so make sure you go ahead and subscribe to that as well hey yo sit sit what up how you been? I've been doing good. Chilling, you? I'm good. You look nice. <laughs> Real chill today, huh? Really? I like this whole tomboy look you going for. Thank you. I try to dress real comfortable when I'm off. I feel it. Where you headed? About to go catch some brunch and then probably go to the gym. I need to hit the gym too. You trying to work me out? Well, I mean, help me work out. I know what you mean. You funny. Where's Aubrey? I'm low-key serious about that workout, though, but <laughs> she at class. Probably where you need to be. Nah, I'm good. Plus, my egg donor made me mad, so if I was skipping, it'd be for a good cause. But what's up with your homegirl, uh, Pia? Pia? What you mean? Like, is she single-single or not? Nah? <laughs> she probably is now. Now? What do you mean? Nothing. You asking for Aubrey? Well, yeah. It seems like me and you picking up on their chemistry quicker than they are. <laughs> True. But in Pia's defense, she got a lot going on. But she's definitely available. I feel you. I'm just trying to make sure before I send my dog out into the wilderness or some shit. You're right. I will hope my BFF will do the same for me. Speaking of BFFs, let me hit yours up and ask if you see. <laughs> Single as you, little daddy. But check this out. I got eight minutes to make it to this brunch, and if I miss this BLT, that's your ass. All right. Later. Bye. Y'all can keep the whole shit. I'm vulnerable, yeah, truth is I need some love, I mean, I need your love, yeah. wake up in the morning, I'm stretching and I'm yawning, all alone I'm rolling like a backwood, I wish you would blow my back up, yeah, I would let you if I could, yeah. I don't understand why I'm acting like a savage when I'm vulnerable. I'm vulnerable. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm vulnerable. I'm vulnerable. Yeah, 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 yeah. Y'all can keep that. I need your 
sun I wake up in the morning I'm stretching and I'm yawning All alone I'm rolling like a backwoods I wish you would blow my back up, yeah I would let you if I could, yeah I don't understand why I'm acting like a savage When I'm vulnerable mm, I'm vulnerable All right, bro. I just got here. I hit you back when I leave. Man, if you since you love her so damn much, how about I have her adopt you so I can be relieved of her bullshit? <laughs> Idiot. Bye, AB. This kid. Casey here? Mm -mm, she didn't say she was here. Nah. Oh, she did live about 10 minutes ago. How you doing? I'm good, cooling it. Just had to get out the house for a bit, you feel me? Ooh, I feel it. I'm mean, here just trying to get this stench out. What stench? You trying to ward off some negativity or something? Mm, no, no negativity. Just some pure bullshit. Oh, bullshit. Her personality must be trash. Sex game weak. <laughs> nah. The sex is always good. She just wants something I can't give her right now. And we had an agreement that neither of us was looking for that. So. I, was, I was just joking, but you play a play, huh? No. But I just respect agreements. Oh, okay. I get that. I was about to say, you sound pretty brutal. First of all, it's not being brutal. It's actually quite adult, but but I can be gentle and humane when I need to be. I can only imagine. You, you funny, Morgan. How? Because you know what you be doing. I'm just confident and in touch with myself, okay? Yeah, I bet you be touching yourself. <laughs> you an idiot. <laughs> You good? Huh? No. My fault. Uh, yeah, I'm good. You sure? Cause like, you got all quiet and shit there for a second. Oh, no. I, I'm, I'm good. It's just, I slick got into it with my mom the other day. She be blowing me sometimes. Dang. What happened? Like, if you don't, I mean, if you want to share. Uh, nah, it's, it's nothing. She, she's just aggravated. She keep trying me. I'm gonna have to put her ass in the old folks home in about 2.5 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're not the only one with trouble in paradise. What'd you get yourself into? Well, like I was explaining earlier, my friend is like trying to tie me down. And I just keep trying to tell her like, this is not the type of party. I wanna be free, I wanna be single. Like I wanna live my best life. And that's what we agreed to. So when I put her in her place, she called herself getting upset. I mean, like trying to argue and everything. And I'm like, girl, I'm not about to argue with a girl that can barely boil water. Like, damn, it's like that. So she got to be able to cook too. Listen, <laughs> cause you funny. Like, I really do feel like there is something in the atmosphere. Like it must be a full moon or something like dead ass. Cause it's just too much like, intensity and energy as a matter of fact cause, no mm. yep look right there mercury retrograde i told you whatever that means yeah <laughs> i told you See, that's why niggas be trying to argue and shit okay pia since you want to talk let's talk then shit who the fuck is erica okay i'll tell you who the fuck erica is you wanna know so damn much? Listening to Sydney all damn night. Okay, come on, let's talk. Let me go get my Palo Santos. Pete, can okay. we just talk? Okay. For real. So saying that you wanna play this yeah. fucking game with me? Man, you the only one that's playing yeah. fucking yeah. games. I'm the one that's yeah. playing. I'm yeah. the one that's playing games now. Yo, Cash, I've been. Done with your ass for years, bruh. Like, 
trying to be an adult, be the bigger person, spare your feelings. Nigga, I was here for you when your family abandoned you and this is how you repay me? <laughs> I didn't even say no to you when, oh my God, I didn't even say no when you proposed to me in front of all of our friends no. to not hurt your feelings. And for what? Man, you ain't been here, Peter. That's it? What else am I supposed to do? <laughs> Man, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. How long? Just listen to me, okay? How long, Cassandra? How long? Just let me explain. How fucking long? Just, just listen, alright? I'm listening, you're not saying anything! How long have you been fucking with Little Miss? <laughs> Erica. I'm listening. Three years. <laughs> Are you serious? But you haven't been here. We've been together for how long? And you, you, are you serious? Are you fucking kidding me? Uh, I'm sorry. Just, I didn't know you felt uh, like this. Just, <laughs> here, just wait. Just hear me out. All right, babe. Calm down. I didn't know you felt like this. You ain't never told me this before. You selfish ass bitch. Oh. Come on now. We don't get down like that. <laughs> I fucking love your trifling ass. I love you. <laughs> I fucking love you. And this is what you do to me. <laughs> you kept telling me you wanted to work on us. Be but better. I do. How? If this is working on us, be better. Oh, baby, I'll be home soon. Oh, no, my mom needs me. <laughs> Your mom needed you, but nigga, what about me? <laughs> what about me? I'm here now, babe. Kind of late for that, huh? <laughs> Funny thing is, though, I wouldn't even be tripping so hard had you said a couple of months. But no, no, <laughs> cash, good old cash, three fucking years you've been fucking with another bitch. Well, can we put this down? Well, I should have been saying that to you. Could you put it down? Oh, but wait, you were. It was Erica, right? Okay. Hmm. I fucking hate you. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry, mm. please. No, I'm sorry. Please. I'll do whatever it takes. Back up. I'll do whatever you want. Just tell me what to do. Please. It's too late. I'm sorry. You're sorry. No, baby. You're only sorry you got caught. I need some time to get shit off my mind. And that shit is you Cause you ain't no good Maybe I'll pull a tray But then I'll start thinking uh, Thinking about you And look what I do I'm calling you I don't know why I do this This is so stupid And I know I am not stupid Damn. Thought I went through this shit Swear this the last time I do this Said that the last time I did this I don't know what I'm missing Swear that the proof's in the pudding That you ain't good, no, no